what's up guys it's nail wednesday welcome back to my channel to all the new and old subscribers big up on yourself remember to put god first keep him as the center of your life and if you haven't given him a chance try it so right now i'm gonna test myself i'm gonna go out of my comfort zone and try something new yes i've um apply rhinestone on this nail set but i'm going to go in depth on in another video as to how i did that if you don't know please remember to like comment share subscribe thumbs up this video turn on your notification bell to keep posted on my latest video and if you're a beginner like me basically i haven't been to any classes i haven't started doing anything as such i'm just um watching a lot of videos practicing practicing and one of the things that i realize when you practice a lot you eventually get it you will get it and just try to come out of your comfort zone as a beginner and remember to write down your key points and take on things that you have learned because it's easy to just slip away from it especially if you have a full-time job and you have kids at home looking at and all those things so anyways guys don't know enjoy this video give it a thumbs up because your girl is improving and this set i'm so proud of this set who could ever know i didn't reach this far thank god and for persons who are beginner i know when they're just starting they may make a lot of mistakes and a lot of do a lot of stupidness basically but do not be ashamed and do not be afraid of your mistakes right because one of the things that assist me and help me to develop in doing nails is the fact that when i do my nails i i, I post it on youtube and i watch it over and when i watch it over i will be able to pinpoint where i am going wrong and what are some of the things that i'm doing that is causing me to get to not get to the next level in doing nail art and it is a very it is a very it is very motivational it's very inspirational when you watch your videos or you watch it's good to document your journey when you look back a couple months from now or a couple weeks from now and you see what you usually do from what you, you, you're doing now it is very inspiration and it just strikes something inside of me that say yes girl continue to do what you're doing because as you can see girl baby girl baby baby girl result is coming and trust me guys this is just me i self-taught myself yeah i haven't been to any classes nobody showed me an armor stuff go on youtube watch the videos practice 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 right now what i learned and as i said it's very important but important my bad to document your journey that will be able to tell you and let you see what it is what is it you're doing wrong and if you're a youtuber if you have a channel i get the pranks and stuff just try and implement nail videos on your channel evil for one day that will give you the drive to want to get up and do nail videos right because if you announce to your subscriber that you'll be doing um nail videos are doing whatever videos you want to do whatever thing is your passion and you implement it in your channel on a particular day it will give you the drive to get up and push because you say it's only one or two day i'll be able to upload this video or do this video right because it's not a part of your, your your channel goal so that will push you each day to have something ready for your subscribers and in that way you will learn and you will develop and you will grow i want to big up to father god because it would have been possible if it wasn't for him anyways guys i'm just gonna leave you all now to enjoy the video Thank you again for watching. Please leave a comment down below. I know lots of person watching my videos are not commenting. Just say something. If I ever I okay, bye.
and remember always try to protect your brushes your nail brushes because if your brushes are damaged or it's not um, working properly you won't be able to do the best unless you use a, as a, a specialist or a skillful like that this is what I do I dip my brush into the liquid into the monomer and coat them together so they can stick together and prevent any damage 